Hello and welcome to Sunday Night Football. Anthony Hudson with you. Tonight's blockbuster is being held at Loftus Stadium. Wonderful weather for football. Alongside me for this match will be Gary Lyon. Welcome, Gaz. Hi, Hunter. Big game tonight. Can't wait. Tonight, Fremantle and the Cats. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp. And the crowd are appreciating it. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. It's a big day for the Cats courts. If they can get on top of the Fremantle defence, they'll go a long way to winning the game. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp. And the crowd are appreciating it. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. Of course, Hunter. The captains converge for the toss of the coin. Geelong winning the toss. These lineups look very strong, and both teams look fired up and set to go. Both sides look ready to get into the action just moments away now. We're underway. Me won the hit out. Doing well was five. Receives the handball and takes off. Finding the loose ball was eight. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Sinks the slipper into it. Ends up turning this ball over. Uses it by foot. A big contested grab. Got boot to ball. Marks now and can send it back. Easily takes the mark. Clears the congestion. Jenkins, the better man there. Uses it now. The loose ball scooped up. Couldn't get the hand pass away, so he just threw it. Brayshaw checks it forward. Ryan kicks it out of defence. The umpire pays the free for deliberate. Stephen heading to the bench. Drives towards half forward. Nice work from Hawkins. Keeps it moving. Looks up with a kick. Doesn't hold on to the mark. A poorly executed tackle there. Just kicks it long. A strong pack mark. Kicked by Cox. And the mark will be paid. Chera urged on by the crowd. Prepares the kick. He drives it. Takes an uncontested mark. Moves the ball by foot. Tucker can't hold on to the tackle. Brayshaw marks it. We are yet to see a score in this one. A mark by Anagola. Keeps the kick low. Great mark in the pack. Elects to kick. Rowan got hands to it. Ryan dug out the loose ball. Hands that ball to the opposition. Blakely puts it out in front. Hamlin onto the ball. Drives it long. Mundy marks in a bit of space. Puts it on the boot. Great mark under pressure. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Looks to move it by foot. Finds this and marks well. 50 metres from home. Still no score for both sides. Going for goal number one. Guthrie will be upset with that. McCarthy gets wrapped up by Blitzart. Fantastic pressure there. Duncan with the mark. Stabs at the kick. Both teams wasting opportunities early. Stewart just gets a boot to it. Selwood gets right on his face. Great attack on the ball carrier. Gets it away with the ball now. 
kicks Goldwood, but it won't have the desired outcome. Now they lead by one. Players move as they look to provide an option. Kolya wins the marking contest. Puts boot to ball. He couldn't hang on. Mundy gains possession. Kicks in heavy traffic. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Searches for a teammate downfield. Selwood marks. He puts it out of bounds on the fall. Banfield drives the kick. Ends up turning this ball over. Chose to kick it. Takes it well. 50 metres out. Monday going for number one. Lucky to score with that shot. All locked up on the scoreboard. Henderson playing up the options now. Goes by foot. Menegola runs after the ball. A clean pickup. Stephen with a spearing kick. Dahlhouse looking to track down the footy. Penetrating handball. Wasting a lot of effort there. Ablett just threw it. Decides to kick. Intercepts the ball well. Moved on by Rowan. Marks now and can send it back. Goes with the kick. Over the top of the pack. Blakely kicks it. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Hill moves it now. Matir has it. Slams it on the boot. Bounces over the line. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. A great match. Fighting hard was Matera. Dangerfield just put it on the boot. Decides to keep it alive. Here's Menegola. With the ball is Banfield. Just gave it away. Tucker gets a quick kick away. The ball find Hill. With a driving kick. Found space for an easy mark. Just threw the ball. Dangerfield collects the kick. An eventful quarter, and it sees the scores level at the turn. A slow start to this game for both sides. Nobody really establishing their dominance early. What do the stats tell us, Gaz? It's a very tight game right now. Thanks for that, Gary. Players ready to start the second quarter. Thrashes it. He's got the football now. Hill brushed off easily. Collects the loose ball. Hawkins picks up the loose ball. Packs it out of there. Doing well to intercept that kick. Slams it on the boot. Ryan marks uncontested. Taken by Conker. And the ball trickles over the boundary. Ball back into play. Meek gets onto the ball. Steven a bit too casual with the tackle. The ball ends up going to ground. The ball mopped up. And now Pierce. Mundy goes to the man on the run. Puts on the afterburners. Collecting high fives now after that goal. Of course, no. That's his first. Look at them celebrate that effort. Puts the first goal on the board. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Duncan gets the ball. Has it now. Ball up in the centre square. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Ball up in the centre square. Clears the contest.
Stephen running off for a break. And we'll get a ball up. Swatson. Bounce. Works for Ablett. Finding the ball was Rowan. The tackle over the shoulder. Moves it by foot. Takes the mark. A chance to put one through here for Fremantle. Mundy puts it on the boot. Stands tall and marks. 40 metres out. Chera going for number one. Just leaves them in his wake. Great goal. He's excited about that one. A handy lead for the Dockers. Stanley with the punch. Conker will be the recipient of the free. Elects to kick. Takes the that one strong. Matera heads long with that kick. Rowan steals possession. Up for grabs for Tabernard. He gains possession. Stanley thrashes it. Five sockers it forward. Scoops it up. He just can't get out of the action. We'll get a stoppage. Thump clear. Mops up the loose ball. Couldn't take it. Well taken at ground level. Meek coming onto the ground. And the umpire will ball it up. Thrashes it. The ball in the hands of five. It'll be a ball up on the outer wing. Punched away. Dug out the loose ball. Just put it on the boot. Rowan did well to win that ball. Geelong would love to make the most of this opportunity. Might be too far out to score. Going for goal number one. It was always pushing that post and pushing it so hard, it hit it. Geelong now only trail by 11. They chase after the loose ball, picked up by Collier. Good mark and looks to send it back. Sinks the slipper into it. Parfit picks it up, wants to keep it moving. Use the hands and gives away the free. It's great to watch her day. Plenty of excitement. Geelong are doing a great job of applying pressure and creating turnovers. It's allowing them plenty of opportunities. They just need to convert those into scores. We'll have another ball up. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. Clean pickup by Henderson. Just put his hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Menegola uses the body well. They'll snatch the lead if this goes through. Takes that one strongly. 15 metres out. It's on again as Geelong take back the lead. This is how they can score big cut out. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. It's very tense at the moment. Back in the middle now. Thumps it clear. He's got the footy in his hands. Duncan uses it by foot. A good mark under the circumstances. Looks up with the kick. He goes for broke. 
just sneaks in from behind. Geelong by two points, ready to bring it back into play. Plays on from the kick in. Uses it by foot. Good body work to win the mark. Chera sends one up towards the wing. Five red at best. Fends off the tackler. Picked up by Conkick. Just manages to release the kick. Finds his man. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. Puts boot to ball. Jenkins with an easy mark. This will have to be his very best kick to score from this far. Goes for the goals. It's only a behind. Geelong Clee is now three. Akers deciding where to go with the kick in. An easy grab for Brayshaw. Brayshaw tucks it into the pocket. Not much time left in the quarter. Five kicks hard along the boundary line. Akers uses the siren sounds, and that's the end of the term. The score. The Cats, 16 to the Dockers, 13. It's been a promising first half for Geelong. They'd be confident they can keep it going in the second half. Let's see what the stats have to show. Geelong have been giving the opposition a chance to move the ball around freely, which is working because they're getting on top once they force a contest. Thanks, Gaz. It's half time, but don't go anywhere. Third quarter action is coming your way next. We're set to go at the start of the third quarter. Clears the contest. He drives it towards goal. Jenkins grabs that one. He might kick a goal. Geelong go for Fremantle, but four. Teammates break for him. Henderson couldn't snaffle it. Dishes it off to a player on the run. Ryan rushes with the kick. It looks like the ball will be coming back. Ace clean from the half volley. Has a runner alongside him. Dug it out. Mundy quickly onto the boot. Nobody can hold on here. Pierce won himself a free. Spears the ball. Matera leaps over the top. This will certainly test him from this distance. Lining up from a 45 degree angle. Big moment to get the lead with this kick. Look at them celebrate that effort. Fremantle go back in the lead again. Stanley got a fist to it. The bounce made it tough for Hawkins. Hill gathers it now. Dishes it off. Conker kicks hurriedly. Gathered by Henry. It'll be a ball up on the outer wing. The game is tightened right up. Stanley won the hit out. Hill collects it. Manufactures the handball. At full stride, receives the handball. Selwood had it, lost it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to him and give him some instructions. Couldn't complete the mark. Now we've got a ball up. Stanley with a big fist on it. Ball up close to the boundary. Thump clear. A good job keeping it in play there. He just throws that ball. Intercepted. Going for goal number one. He's put it through. Tucker celebrates with the fans. Fremantle could kick back-to-back -back goals. Fremantle by eight points. Big thump from Stanley. Collier gets the loose ball. My ball, says the umpire. Stanley thumps it forward. Hamlin collects the loose ball. Gets the loose ball. Pierce slams it onto the boot. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Guthrie puts it on the boot. 
A chance to gather the ball. Dangerfield with a short hand pass. Kicks hurriedly. Good mark there. Putting this one through would give Geelong plenty of confidence. A chance to reload the attack now. Goes with the kick. Ends up marking uncontested. Puts it on the boot. Banfield was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. Keeps the kick low. Takes the mark all by himself. Fremantle haven't been able to set up any set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Doesn't connect with the kick, and it'll be coming back. Hill going for number one. It's a behind. The lead is now nine. Looking for options now. It's a foot race to get this one. Hill now heading off to the bench for a break. A critical stage of this one. Pierce hurls it away. Kicks out of the congestion. Hacking it out of there. Soccer's the kick. Thank you. Swats it. Collected by Henderson. Ace just put it on the boot. Tabernacle takes the mark. Fremantle are allowing too many marks inside the opposition 450. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Guthrie couldn't keep his hands on it. Colin Jasny links up with a chance to run. Had plenty of the ball. Finds the loose ball. Big tackle. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Pierce clears the contest. Menegola unable to hold on. Hamling just gets it out of the booth. Spent that one before he earned it. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's barely touched the ball, honey. Pierce with the hit. Keeps it alive under some pressure. Movement by hand. Ablett finds possession. It's been a great game from Hamling. He just keeps finding the footy. Couldn't quite nail that kick. The lead is now 10. Henderson, unsure of the next move. Open opportunity for Taylor. Fremantle just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Gets the handball away. Parfit dug it out. Pierce picks up the loose ball. We'll get a ball up. Punches are clear. Dug out by Dangerfield. Ablett is having a stellar match. He seems to always be in the contest, Hutto. Henderson soccers a kick. Rowan soccers at home for a goal. His teammates rush over. Oh, there's nothing in it. Centre bounce. Pierce just swats it away. Hamling on the ball. That's the sort of goal that can get the team up and about. He acknowledges the crowd. Ten points the difference. Back with another set of bounce. Thumped by Pierce. Mundy comes away with the ball. Tucker puts his body on the line. The Dockers can work the ball with this free kick. Tucker goes with the kick. Ryan takes the mark and contested. Got boot to ball. Marked by Hill. Gaz, what are your thoughts after that third quarter? The Dockers will be looking to not only hold their lead, but they want to put this beyond doubt early and run away with a big win. Let's have a closer look at the stats. Geelong have turned it over too often today. They aren't coping with the pressure. They should try and slow it down and control the ball for a moment. Thank you, Gaz. One quarter of footy to go. Can't afford any mistakes from here. They have to be perfect. Duncan brushes off the tackle. He has the ball. 
Well picked up. Seen plenty of it. He flicks it over. Menegolik with the ball. Fuse on top of the ranking points. He's having a fantastic game. Pretty happy with that one. The Cats behind by four. The game is back underway. Hammers it with the ball now. They can link up now. Hawkins couldn't stick the tackle. Collier got the hands free. Tucker links up with a chance to run. Does well to cut off the kick. Chose to kick it. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Going for goal number one. Wins the race to the ball. Didn't get low enough with the tackle. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. He can take off after that handball. He drives it. Blitzarves, hurried kick. The ball goes over the line. Stanley coming off for a spell. It's a big stage of this game. Toss back into play. Winning it was Meek. Links with hands. Kicks hurriedly. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Brayshaw has resources out wide. Bit of a harsh call, but the umpire saw it as deliberate. Moves the ball by foot. Hogan couldn't hang on to the ball. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's barely touched the ball, Hunter. He's got the football now. Opportunity for Meek. Meters through it. Buse puts it out on the full. Stabs at the kick. Taylor dug out the loose ball. Punches the kick. Hill a bit too casual with the tackle. Steven gives it off and now they go. He can take off after that handball. Rowan continues to find the ball. You're right, Hunter. He's an absolute ball man. Congratulated by his teammates. That's two in a row for Geelong. Geelong, get on top again. Great bit of play that resulted in that play. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. About to resume hostilities. Meek thumped it clear. Guthrie collects it. Great tackle. Great tackle. Outstanding pressure. Doesn't take the mark. Henry cacking it out of there. He has to hold on to those. Rowan failing to get near it, Gaz. Yeah, he's having a real quiet match, Hunter. Cacking it out of there. Takes a simple grab. Decides to kick. Connor Jasny over the top, almost cut it off. Conkart made the tricky bounce look easy. Releases by hand. Banfield kicks hurriedly. Stewart missed an opportunity to mark. High tackle. Cherak spears the ball. Ablett controlling the airwaves on this occasion. Henry with a chance on the turnover. He wins the ball in the air. Ryan kicks it. Over the top of the pack. Stanley keeps that one low. Snaffled up by Delwood. Releases it under pressure. Stanley getting a chance for a break. Ball up on the outer side wing. It's a very tight game right now. Fife moves it by hand. And now they're away. Fife earns a free kick. The ball goes out of bounds on the full. Cockatoo kicks it long. Ablett drives the kick. Takes a strong mark. The spearing kick from Akers. Brayshaw presents and takes the mark. With a driving kick. Cox determined to reach the ball. Goes by hand to Matera. McCarthy takes the mark. 40 metres from home. A chance to steal the lead right here. They are within a kick. 
considering the options on the kick in he gives chase to the footy finding the loose ball was Ablett racking up possessions now Taylor was taken high in the tackle looks to move it by foot Henry gets in a good position gets a hand in Guthrie can send it back this is a big kick in the context of this game a kick to hit the front we are all tied up now. Henderson with the kick-in duties. Selwood looks to get under the football. No problems with that kick from Cox. He just loved that one. Fremantle, but six. That's a really good team goal. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Umpire ready to resume play. Clears the contest. Dangerfield now. It's cut off by Rowan. Clumsy tackle results in a free kick. Fans crossing their fingers. Hoping he can put this one through the big sticks. Needs a big kick if he's going to put this through. Always looked like a behind. Probably only one roll of the dice left. Searching for a teammate. Akers decides to go to himself. Uses it now. Blakely found some space and marked. Goes by foot. Picks up the loose ball. Can he put it through? Parfit sends the drop punt on its way for another goal. He's enjoying that goal. They've hit the front. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. Back in the middle to resume play now. Thumps it clear. Gains some territory. Picks it up. Two, he handballs out into space. The bounce ends up with Jera. This kick will put them in front. That one rams into the post. The scores are tied. Henderson ready to bring it back into play. He looks like he needs a spell. A low stabbing kick. Can't take the mark. Selwood sends it into space. The umpire calls for it. The game is tightened right up. Pierce thumps it clear. Ablett wins the foot race. Tucker uses the bump. What a game. And after that, we end up back where we started. Scores level. Gaz, what did you think of today's game? Can you believe it? After 120 minutes of footy, we have a draw. Thanks for that, Gaz. Wrapping up this game, and we'll remind you, it was a draw. The score's locked on 42. That's the end of today's broadcast. Thank you for watching. We'll see you later. Thanks, Hutto. Until next time.